Welcome back to Let's Play Darksiders 3. I'm Burning Dogface, and I'm glad to see that Griffin is no, has not respawned. Yet. <laughs> what is that up there anyway? A nest? No, I believe that's a crushed car. Okay, great. Did I look in here? Yes, and there was a thing there. Awesome. Can you pet the dog as a spin-off Twitter account about uh, whether or not there's anything hidden behind a waterfall in any given game? So they should be alerted. Ah, oh, good. Well, this looks like it's gonna be a barrel of fun. Let's get right in. Again, how do you do the slam move onto the ground? Oh, that's right, that was like... Well, I figured out how to do that last night, didn't I? It wasn't just timing. It was like dodging forward at the same time, right? Dang, nabbit. Oh, that's what it was. Yes, right, duh. Yes, in midair. Then you dodge forward and attack. Ahem. Oh, it barely does any damage at all. I'll just position myself just so. Nope, this one is actually dead. Never mind. Huh, that actually was not as much of a pain in the ass as I thought it might be. You can live. Alright, where the hell did I leave off? In these buildings! Yes, that's right. It's not like they were going to use those, let's be fair. Something tells me this wasn't a big ramp when, uh... <laughs> when they had to worry about the speed limit here. Oh. But yes, we're here in the Bone Lands. Looking for treasure and... banners. Are those old human banners that are, like, torn to rat shit? Or are those just, like demon banners, and they just look like that. I guess it's the one up in the alcove I saw just now. Ah, that's right, and I cleared out this room and not this room. No? Okay. I wonder what that smells like. Burning cobwebs. Oh, come on! It's not like anyone's gonna need this shit. Oh, so the wrecking the dumpster is fine, but destroying these useless supplies is... Beyond the pale! Do I hit the garbage can? Bag. Hmm. Does make me wish I had a precision weapon. That wasn't a Mansk. But this is just the other side of that wall I was on. That must be above me. On? No. I was just out there earlier. Oh. Oh. Why do I have to keep whipping the innocent creatures? 
Hello. Bugsy? I hear you, but I can't see you. There you are. I didn't notice until I was looking for a thumbnail in the previous video. But there's something off about the enemies in this place. I mean, I noticed that there's something off about the demons here right away, given that they ha have that, you know, weird hobby of hanging themselves! And not even in a lethal way, which makes it weirder somehow. But the one that stood out to me the most is the angels flying around with dark-colored wings. Now, I admit, I'm terrible at, you know, guessing. Yeah. I'm terrible at my recollections of Darksiders. I have uh, noticed this. But, uh... I feel like a detail as big as, you know, angels having glowy light wings is something that would stick out, right? I'm not crazy about that. Surely. I wonder if this wall was patched up like that before or after the apocalypse. Maybe someone is trying to turn this into a stronghold. Tag, you're it. Well, this is not what I would refer to as an ideal scenario. So let's uh, take efforts to make it more so. Can I turn that off? No. Okay, I'll just burn it out. Oh, well, there's not much transition there, is there? Wrecking all the human shit, doo da, doo da. Why? Oh god, why is that in my head? to punish me for all those tidbits I got wrong earlier. I checked, by the way, it wasn't the uh, same voice actress for Fury and uh, Pride. You see what I mean there? Dark wings. And these ones are made of feathers. Who are these guys? I thought it was only the officers who had, you know, feather wings. Oh, that just wasn't wise. Hi, I've ascended your friend. You want to just wait for him, or... Oh, shit! Achievement unlocked, maximum vigor. Upgrade Nephilim's respite healing amount four times. I did not know I had found that many. Healing, 150 plus 300. Baller! I'm definitely going to put a point into health next time. So we're just going to stand here, staring awkwardly at each other? Because I don't have any ranged weapons, and you're over there. Alright then. Good talk. Arg. And the clutter disappears, too. Hey, I'll bite. Where the hell am I meant to 
Uh, no, go. Ooh. I bet I can get him down, but I don't know where I'm going to go after this. Never mind, I don't need to. Glad I noticed that. So that's all of the rejuvenation cores. I feel satisfied about that. I'm surprised I found them all, given that I'm not even halfway through the list yet. Well, it's a seven item list, so, you know, it's very either or when it comes to being halfway through. Okay, where, does the, where exactly is the compass pointing? Back down the hole. Okay, no, it's pointing over here. Good, good. Just wanted to make sure. No? It can't make up its mind. Fine. That door down there. Hi there. No. I keep glancing away for one second and then it's completely, you know, done that. <laughs> Jeez, lady, don't draw attention to yourself like that. Are you insane? Okay, that's death. And no pipes up here. If I could get to the roof, that would be fine, but I cannot get to the roof. Hmm. Maybe it's just a dead end until I come back with the purple stuff, huh? But it's the only point on my compass. Shit. Okay. Oh, well, don't I feel productive? I could probably wreck that sign. But I won't. Otherwise people won't know to take the corners slow. God, that looks cool. Majestic AF. Ah, oh, yes. The last time I was here... Yeah, the last time I was here, I... Mm, <laughs> I carefully took in this view, and then accidentally stepped in. Opening my mouth to say, you know, I guess I shouldn't go swimming, and then I like, oh. Oh. Embarrassing. I'm not gonna blame that one on the controller, though. That was all me. And hey, it did demonstrate, yes, I shouldn't go swimming here. Oh, that one did fade, did fade out anyway. You know what, this one's actually kind of short. Maybe I can... No, no I cannot. It just won't let me get a good look at it. Okay, fine. Where the hell is Vulgrim? I'll just keep walking backwards, I guess. Oh, hey, Vulgrim. What the hell? Where did you guys come from? Man, 
You guys suck. How is the war even in question? Oops, I missed. So heaven and hell were abiding by the ceasefire because the Charred Council had the power to force them to abide by the ceasefire, hence the Four Horsemen. Uh, but you can bet that they weren't that fond of the idea of waiting thousands of years for some random mortal species to get strong enough to decide one way or the other. Because what happens if you dedicate, you know, 4,000 years or however long it takes to waiting for this to happen, and then they pick the other guys? Greetings. Serpent holes. Please take your time. Let's see, where is that? There's the church. I didn't do a whole lot of looking around here before I wandered off. Let's see. Hey, that's a thing. Can I get up there? I was on top of the other side of the roof at one point, I remember that. Let's not go in that hole just yet. Ooh. Or this one, for that matter. Yeah, I think the only way I could get back out of there is by funding Volgrim again. Huh. Now that I think about it, I'm really surprised there wasn't a boss fight in here. Seems like the sort of place where with all the pews getting smashed aside and everything. Maybe a scripted bit where he throws the altar at me. Oh yeah, I guess, you know, that stands to reason, being the end of days and all. Oh right, his pride thing is over there. Where the fuck? oh, more. Oops, sorry! Oh, there won't be anyone around to remember you any soon anyway. Holy Christ! Where did you come from? You're not dead. Yet. Okay, fuck this. Fuck everyone, in fact. Wreck everything. Flatten this graveyard. We're gonna turn it into a parking lot. The most haunted parking lot on Earth. Come on! Oh, right. Oh, hey! Really gotta get better at watching my health. I actually got called on that yesterday. I was playing a multiplayer game with a friend. I don't like that, this view here, because that doesn't so much look like the sea rose up as it looks like an infinite void swallowed up the world. What the hell? Oh, it's a tree swaying back and forth. I couldn't tell what- I thought it was a giant spider for a second there. Then I thought it was a ship, you know, look at the mast. Okay, that's actually a pretty rad statue. I don't have anything sarcastic to say about that. Wait, are they suggesting this angel got crushed by a car? Oh. Okay, I can't just do that. Well, then how the fuck do I go down there? I 
almost hit select to bring up the uh, the start menu again. Oh, there's the timer. Well, this hasn't been the best video I've ever made, but you know what? I did get an achievement and I got my uh, healing dealie all the way to the top, so that's good. I feel good about that. Oh, okay. Arg, why is there a walkway up here? More importantly, can I go in? No. How about fire? No. Okay! Now then, where is it? I'll just grab this and call it an episode. Thanks, dead demon dude! I will treasure it as long as it takes me to go back to Ulthane and give it to him to smelt down into parts. Hmm. I'm Burning Dog Face, and I'll see you next time on Let's Play Darksiders 3, when we continue scouring the world for goods and services and maybe head back to that unpleasant place and keep looking for the next sin. Who knows what'll happen? Later!